I'm Jason UFC and today we have a story about UFC number one contender in the bantamweight division Henry Cejudo names the most dangerous guy in the bantamweight division other than himself. Henry Cejudo feels the bantamweight um, division is about to be put on notice by one surging contender. Cejudo will return to face the undisputed um, bantamweight um, champion Aljamain Sterling for the UFC bantamweight title at UFC 288 in May. I believe that is happening in New Jersey. He's following a three-year hiatus from um, competition after announcing his retirement after a win at UFC 249. Henry Cejudo is looking to reclaim the bantamweight throne and prove that ring rust is just a miss, myth. As he returns to the division he once reigned over as the champion, the division has become more stacked and talent rich. Rich. It's uncertain how long Henry Cejudo intends to continue fighting, but he got his eyes on one surging contender named Umar Nomaga Madoff. During a recent segment on his YouTube channel, Henry Cejudo named Umar Nomaga Madoff as the quote quote unquote dark horse of the bantamweight division okay umar is the most dangerous guy at 135 pounds out of all of these cats that i see umar nomagamadov is the tough and challenge um for any bantamweight including myself umar can wrestle umar can strike umar can box umar nomagamadov is well-rounded he's seen his brother and his cousin win world titles and he wants to be next okay wow we're gonna come back to that in a recent tweet umar nomagamado thanks um henry cejudo for the high praise this is what umar says triple c knows best thank thank you so much champ and good luck this is that's interesting that in the tweet um umar nomagamado referred to henry cejudo as champ Right, even though Al Jermaine is the current champion and Henry Cejudo is the number one contender fighting for the championship belt, it's you know it's interesting that um, Umar Nomaga Madoff um, referred to Triple C Henry Henry Triple C Cejudo as champ, and he said good luck to um, um, Henry Cejudo. So this is interesting um, when when Henry Cejudo says that. Um, that Umar Nomaga Madoff have seen his brother and his cousin. He's referring to his brother, who is the current reigning um, lightweight champion. I believe he's a lightweight champion. Usman Nomaga Madoff, who just defeated. He's a lightweight champion in Bellator. In Bellator, Bellator. Um, he's a lightweight champion. 155. Is it 155 pounds? Is he the lightweight champion? He's not. Yeah, he is a lightweight. Yeah, he, yeah, he defeated the pitbull guy. Yep. Usman Nomagamadov is the lightweight champion in Bellator, 155-pound division. I believe he's undefeated, and I believe he just defeated Benson Henderson in his last fight. Um, Umar Nomagamadov defeated Benson Henderson, and I believe Benson Henderson retired after the fight. It was pretty sad to see, actually. Huge fan. WEC never die. But, yeah, that's who. Um, that's Umar Nomagamadov's brother is... Um, Usman Nomago made of current reigning undisputed undefeated Bellator lightweight champion I believe and his cousin obviously we all know Habib Nomago made of who was also undefeated and right undisputed lightweight champion so um Umar Nomago made of actually in the bantamweight division um well, 20 pounds lighter than everybody else but he trains with you know obviously he probably trains with his brother Usman he probably trains with the current reigning undisputed lightweight champion in UFC um Islam uh Makashev right so um Umar Nurmagomedov could be a problem maybe a lot of people I'm pretty sure once they see the last name Nurmagomedov they kind of know who he is but do they really know who he is is he going to be a guy that's fighting for the belt next year around this time it's very 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 possible it's not impossible um I don't really know his record or anything like that. You know, he doesn't have any, like, high-profile wins on his record that I know of. But, you know, he definitely, you know, I don't know if he's the most dangerous guy in the um, bantamweight division. Um, 
but we'll see, right? Like, he has to be given the opportunity to, to fight, you know, a top 10, top 5 ranked bantamweight. And we can see where he's really at, um, Umar Namagamadov. But let me know your opinion of this story. Do you agree with Henry Cejudo that um, Umar Namagamadov is the most dangerous guy in the bantamweight division? Or is there someone else in the bantamweight division that you think is more dangerous than Umar Namagamadov? I'm Jason, UFC. Today we had a story about Henry Cejudo, um, UFC number one con bantamweight contender, names Umar Namaga Madoff as the most dangerous guy in the bantamweight division. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the $1 donation button, and please tune in to the next video on this channel. Thanks a million for watching.